Nigerians in Ireland. It was a beautiful day last year. We had so much fun. And the whole idea of the carnival is to celebrate ourselves as Nigerians, a people of culture, a people of respect, a people who bring something very special with us all the way across the sea here to Ireland. There's been so much stereotyping of Nigeria as a nation and Nigerians as a people. Unfortunately, when people meet 10 Africans, automatically they think that a majority of those 10 are Nigerians. And when anything negative happens, especially when they talk in the area of corruptions and things like that, Nigerians are easily stereotyped. But the truth of the matter is, in this age and time, one bad apple doesn't necessarily have to spoil the whole bunch because you have a great bunch of apples and you can just stick out the one bad one. Can't you do that? Do you agree with me? That's very true. So this is what we're doing with the carnival. We're in Ireland and the carnival is a celebration of culture. It's a celebration of diversity in Ireland. Ireland is now a multicultural nation. And in the midst of all that multiplicity, we want to show that we can all come together as a people and learn from each other. We have come with so much from Africa. People from Asia have come with so much. The people we live here with the Ireland have so much we can share from them. So we want this to be an avenue for integration, for us to be able to know much, know a lot about each other. It's funny though that even some of our children here in Ireland, those of us from Africa, unfortunately we're beginning to lose some of the things that make us Africans and we don't want to forget that. And I'm not talking about traditions, no. I'm talking about the good bits. The bits about respect. Respect is very, very important. And I believe that this is something we can share. The bit about morals about knowing what is right and what is wrong and choosing the right. Those are the kind of things we want to share about us as a nation. And we hope that this platform, the Nigerian Carnival Island, will be able to sell all that idea to everyone that comes around here. Last year, it was just one day, the 27th, um, the 28th of August. But this year, Nigerian Carnival Island has grown so big. It, it was at least a one week event. The carnival started off on Monday, last Monday. We had the welcome ceremony on Monday. It was a beautiful day. We had another event on the Tuesday. On Wednesday, we had a charity fashion show, and it was an aid of the Gary Kelly Cancer Support Center in Joida. And it was a one for those who were there. It was an absolutely wonderful event, and people really appreciated the different costumes from Nigeria. The bit I loved the most when people were trying out how to tie the gilly. Oh my goodness, it was interesting and it was funny. But we had a great day on the day. On the Thursday, we had um, the uh, cultural dance competition. 
we had a vintage on the Friday, a custom visit, and here we are today at the carnival. Barring the rain, it is going to be a wonderful day. Like Regina right, rightly said, this is Ireland. When you go out in Ireland, you have your raincoat, you have your umbrella, you have a light dress under, and you have your coat because it could start raining. You have your umbrella, it gets cold. You have your coat, it gets warm. You take it off. You have something under. We have all the weathers all around. We prepare for it. So we're ready for today, and we. Yes. I can't hear you. We are ready for today, and we. And it's going to be the same today. Regardless of the rain, we're going to have a wonderful day. Thank you all so much. We want to thank all our exhibitors here. We're going to go around later and do a tour of, uh, of the, um, the different stands that we have. Thank you all so much for being a part of the carnival this year. Um, the African Mission, Mary Kay Cosmetics, Kill Collection, um, the Hairdressers with Bonnie, um, Ideal Diamond Group, um, African Women Development Initiative, um, we also want to thank um, Debbie Mosuya, we have our information desk there, and we have the official um, animal restaurant. There is plenty of food and plenty of, we have our drink corner there as well, um, at Joe um, Jo Day. So please enjoy yourself and ask ice cream for the kids. We have our children's village at the corner, face painting, karaoke, the works. So kids, are you going to paint your faces?